Chef, what is chef? I think uh, the parents must be more worried than the students who have passed out from institutes. It's not easy to be a chef. It's a difficult task. It's a very difficult task. I'm not demotivating. I'm trying to motivate the boys or girls who are here who are going to take their career as a chef. The, uh, the respect and the honor and the satisfaction what we get after seeing smile on our guest face is more than what guests are enjoying. That's more important, this, the satisfaction which we take home, back home. Okay, it's like, you know, in India, chefs were not treated that well earlier or hotelier. When I started my career in 1983, I am from Mumbai Catering Institute. When I took admission in Catering Institute, people thought, okay, I don't know how many of you understand Hindi, they thought, okay, come mark I honge, isliye chef banne ja rahe hai in hotel industry, they are joining, they have joined hotel industry, and even it, it was not easy. I, uh, my, my father was working in a small mithai shop in uh, Mumbai, so I used to visit the uh, factory where the mithais are made, you know, there I developed interest in uh, culinary, and uh, then I thought of joining Catering Institute. I knew Chef Satish Arora. He was, uh, he's my godfather. He uh, was in Taj Mahal, Mumbai as executive chef those days. So my brother was his friend actually. So I met Chef Satish Arora. He said, why don't you join Catering Institute? And when in uh, 12th standard, minimum mark required was around 65 to 70%. Without that, they were not giving admission in Catering Institute. There were only four institutes those days in India. One in Mumbai, Calcutta, Delhi, and uh, Chennai. The best chefs were produced from Chennai Catering Institute those days, I am still aware. Then Chef Satish Arora helped me to get admitted in admission in uh, Catering Institute in uh, Dadar, which is in Mumbai. I passed out and then I joined Oberoi's Mumbai. I worked in Oberoi's for 16 years. It was not easy for me to uh, grow the, up the ladder, you know, because those days only four or five hotels were there in India. And when we get into any hotel, the promotion was very difficult. It was not easy. When we used to ask promotion to our bosses, they, sh they used to say, no, no, you are too young for promotion. And by the time we became elder, we asked for promotion, they, they said, no, no, you are too old for promotion now. <laughs> so that, this our generation in between got lost. But now the things are different. Whenever the students are passing out from Catering Institute, if they have potential, world is the market for them. The entire world is open for them. They can be celebrity chef. They can be chef as chef. I can see chef is working in cruise liner. I met one chef today uh, uh, evening. He uh, introduced me to his son. He said, chef, my son has joined Catering Institute. I have refused him to join, but still he insisted that he want to join Catering Institute. I was very happy. I said, why you? You asked him that you should not join Catering Institute. It is a great institute now and great career. Definitely world is market for you. It depends on your attitude, your thinking. 60% uh, or 70% of chefs around the world in cruise liners are from India. It's not a small number. Most of the top cruise liners are run by Indian chefs. It's not small number. Big market, big value. You have to understand your potential, your courage, your hard work. Sky is limit. All the best to you and all the best to the parents. Parents have done their work. Parents have spent so much of money on the students or the children. Now it's children's duty to return back the, the parents the dues, you know. Don't forget your parent. Ensure that you give total full respect to your parents and your teacher. I know Chef Vinod since uh, 15 years now. I was executive chef of Meridian here in 19 and uh, 2002 or 2003. That's the first time I chef, met Chef Vinod. He was very young. And my wife saw his carving the other day. Uh, I think 20 years back she said, I want to learn carving from Chef Vinod. Still, still pending. Chef Vinod, you have to still, she's waiting to learn carving from you. Maybe I was a guard major chef, I know carving, but she said, no, no, I will not learn from you, I will learn from Chef Vinod. So, all the best to all the students.
and I congratulate all the parents, especially parents are very important and make sure you respect your parent and don't forget your parent even if you are in Mars or Moon or US or America or Australia, don't forget your parents. That's the only request from my side.